Welcome back. You're watching Lunch Money. Let's uh, shift focus to Deal Street, a segment where we focus on the buzzing uh, e-commerce and startup space. Today we focus on online uh, rea reality companies. Uh, many industry experts believe that this is one area in online space that could see a big time consolidation going forward. I'm being joined by the CEO and co-founder of Common Floor, Sumit Jain. Uh, Sumit, great to have you on the show. Uh, I'm going to start by asking you uh, the, the question that everybody's been talking about. We hear from sources that you are in the process of due diligence to buy a stake in indiaproperty.com. Uh, uh, I want to get your comments on this. Uh, is this true? See, I, they are market speculations and we don't comment on market speculations. Okay, okay. Okay, so I, I'm going to come back to that piece, but uh, you recently launched a virtual tour feature platform. Uh, the, what uh, uh, sense are you getting from the initial kind of uh, reaction to it? Has this helped increase traction? Because that's the big focus area for many of the online royalty companies right now. Yes, certainly it has helped uh, the seekers uh, get right properties. So if I tell you, people are spending three times more, three times more amount of time for those who spend earlier without leaving tours. So people are actually spending time on visiting common floor, browsing these virtual tours instead of actually traveling in the market and visiting the wrong properties. So we say that uh, stop visiting wrong property and start visiting common floor. So what is happening? One is that the time spent has increased. Second is that the quality of leads actually have gone up. So earlier the the 50 percent leads used to be uh, about let's say is there a geyser in the bathroom and about very basic uh, information. After leaving tours, what happened? The quality of leads have gone up by 70 percent. So the, the leads which are coming to the owners or the property dealers, the leads are 70% more qualified. But, uh, you know, com competitors are also pumping a lot of money on the ad spends, uh, Sumit, uh, because the whole idea is to get more eyeballs. What is common floor strategy uh, to increase the customer base, the pure customer base at this juncture? The our strategy is, uh, is through product. So what we believe in is that the product should speak in itself and the customer should speak for yourself. So thing is that uh, what we are focusing on where the competitors are actually busy spending a lot of money, we are actually busy in building product and getting great content and we have launched this feature called Live in Tours where we are able to help people find properties, select properties and reject properties online. So our strategy is to invest heavily on product and make sure that we are able to help buyers buy with confidence on common floor. What does this mean in terms of cash burn, the kind of um, outreach program that you are doing and uh, you know, of the money that you've raised, how much is actually going uh, uh, to this particular feature? So we have raised uh, over $50 million. That doesn't include the last round uh, from Google Capital. And I can tell you, we have not even burnt half of it. We still have half the money sitting in our bank. And uh, we, have, we have invested heavily on product and technology and content. And that is where we, we invest heavily and we are going to invest heavily on. Uh, to make sure that we have a right product, we using technology and data, we want to empower all the st stakeholders in the real estate ecosystem. Okay. Last question, Sumit. Uh, any uh, plans to um, uh, raise capital uh, going ahead? See, we have never scouted for funding actively in our history. And it just happened. We happened to meet Google Capital in New York. And then we happened to actually meet them again in Mountain View and the funding happened. So a similar thing, what is happening, uh, if we like investors and if we believe, if we, if we like to work with them, then actually the funding happens. So we are not actively looking to raise funding and we are very well capitalized. But if we like the investors, uh, we might go for it. Right. It's normally when the investors like you, uh, Sumit, but we leave it over there. Thank you so much for joining us. With that, it's a wrap on this edition of Lunch Money. Up next is Market Pulse. Do stay tuned. Thank you.